The most bizarre and dangerous fashion trends in history. They say that beauty is pain, and throughout history, people have gone to extreme lengths to meet the beauty standards of their time. Today, we might wax, contour, and bleach, but our ancestors took things to a whole new level. Let us take a look at some of the most bizarre and dangerous fashion trends in history. 1. Receding hairlines. Have you ever noticed something odd about the women in old Renaissance paintings? Large, smooth foreheads were all the rage back then. To achieve this look, women would pluck or shave back their hairlines, sometimes even appearing almost bald under their headdresses. 2. No eyelashes or eyebrows. The Renaissance beauty standards did not stop at hairlines. Eyebrows and eyelashes were considered over-sexualized, so women would pluck them out entirely. Imagine the pain of removing every single eyelash. 3. Teeth blackening. In Japan, teeth blackening, known as ohaguro, was a common practice. This was done to signify beauty and maturity, with women, and sometimes men, blackening their teeth as a sign of coming of age or marital status. It was a painstaking daily ritual during the Edo period. 4. Veiny cleavage. In 17th century Europe, pale skin signified wealth. Women would go to great lengths to ensure their cleavage appeared so pale it was nearly translucent, sometimes even drawing blue veins on their chests to enhance the effect. 5. Erotic piercings. Nipple piercings were all the rage among wealthy Victorian women. Known as bosom rings, these piercings were sometimes connected with delicate chains. An 1890 edition of Vogue even featured an article on this trend. 6. Foot binding. The Chinese tradition of foot binding is one of the most extreme beauty practices in history. Starting around the age of six, girls' feet were tightly bound to stunt growth and forced them into a deformed shape considered attractive. This painful practice lasted for centuries and left lasting scars. 7. Skull shaping. Skull shaping was practiced by various ancient cultures, including the Mayans. Infants' heads were strapped to boards to flatten and elongate their skulls, a process believed to enhance beauty and status. 8. Short teeth. During the Renaissance, short teeth were considered beautiful. Women preferred baby-sized teeth over the dazzling smiles we admire today. However, since few people had perfect teeth, they often kept their mouths closed in portraits. 9. Long nails. In the Qing dynasty, both men and women grew their nails up to 10 inches long. These impractical nails signified wealth, as they indicated the wearer did not need to do manual labor. Ornate nail guards were often used to protect these lengthy manicures. 10. Buff calves. From the Middle Ages to the 18th century, strong, muscular calves were a must-have for men. They would wear stockings to show off their legs, and some even padded their calves for extra emphasis. 11. The unibrow. In ancient Greece, a unibrow was a sign of beauty and intelligence in women. Those without a natural unibrow would use dark powder to create the illusion of one. 12. The Divorce Corset In the 19th century, the divorce corset was in vogue. It created a wider bust by separating the breasts, sometimes using padding to achieve the desired look. This was just one of many corset styles that shaped women's bodies to fit the era's beauty standards. 13. S-Bend Corsets The Edwardian era brought us the S-Bend Corset, this extreme corset forced the hips backward, creating an unnatural arch in the back and an S-shape. This silhouette enhanced the bustle of their dresses but caused long-lasting spinal damage. 14. Beauty Patches In the 18th century, beauty patches were all the rage. These small pieces of fabric were stuck to the face to mimic beauty marks. They came in various shapes and their placement indicated different traits, like flirtatiousness if placed near the mouth. 15. Painted Stockings During World War II, women could not get new pantyhose due to trade shortages. They improvised by painting their legs to look like stockings, sometimes even using gravy as a substitute for paint. From plucking out eyelashes to binding feet, history is full of bizarre and dangerous fashion trends. These practices remind us of the lengths people have gone to meet societal beauty standards. Which of these trends shocked you the most? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Science Deli for more fascinating dives into history and science. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.